Hey, how's it going everybody? It's me George and I'm just bringing a, I guess a haul video of Mesco and uh, NECA figures from Target. But I'll start with the Target ones first. Saw this guy. They had a, lot, a bunch of new restock or whatever figures and I picked up the Ultimate T-800. And these guys I guess for everybody to know like yes they're reissues so it's like brand new and you have to be worrying about like oh damn I didn't get it the first time you know figure so hopefully it shows on the but again I'm price I'm still gonna do uh, like each review or whatever each figure soon so pick up this guy can't wait to check him out or review it or whatever you call it or show the details or what it comes with or whatever so got him and then picked up like like I said what I've been waiting for the old school one the Terminator 2 Future War Metal Mash Terminator Endoskeleton. There we go, it shows. Love like the, the packaging. It's like the Kenner, but NECA. <laughs> so like I said, Mando was kinda like the other one like I had that I did the review or showed off of last week. So yeah. And then there's like thousands more, so can't wait to check out this guy. See, even the the, the freaking weapon is like already bent already, and there's like nothing holding it back. So it's like I don't know why why is it all bent and shit. Yeah, whatever. I fix it up the hair dryer, the hot water trick. So so yeah, looks pretty cool, man. Looks fucking badass. So can't wait to check this out. And the last one that I got was the, what is it, the Arnold one, it really shows, it's crazy when I had this, I used to have this one the back back in the day, I only had like three of them, the T, the, the T, the T-1000, the one that, that looks like the character, that's what it was kind of tripped out, that you had the T-1000 and, and then the, the Arnold, the one that has half and then you just press a button and it explodes, I had that one and then this, this guy, and that was it. Those were the only three I had. So yeah. So I got him. So it'll be um, boxing or whatever, unwrapping, whatever the hell you want to call it, man. <laughs> be showing him later, but oh yeah, but talking about like unboxings and showing each detail of each figure that I have here in the hall. Finally got like a one of my friends let me one of his um, some badass phone that he had or whatever that he's trying to get rid of. So letting me use it. So finally get to do like a 4K video, you know quality for you guys so to show each detail of the figure and what it comes with and I don't know my, my review my thoughts of the of the action figure statue figure whatever the hell see I can't even talk around it's kind of late right now it's already like 11 something at night but anyways <laughs> I'm already out of it but the last figure that I got of the day was uh, picked up the Mesco Catwoman I always wanted to get this one even though I saw a lot bunch of other videos reviews that one of the arms breaks it breaks more easily the left or right arm or whatever so got the Catwoman the Mesco so I got this one sorry for the glare the, again darkness so I'll be reviewing this on camp so I can't wait to unbox or show off that one and again like I said with the new the phone or whatever the quality the 4k or a better type of look so what else, what else, what else, oh yeah, so, little quick little update thing, story thing of the, like, payday, I didn't even get paid yesterday, it was one of those things where, get direct deposit and check, and oh yeah, one o'clock in the morning, I want to get the money real easy from the ATM or whatever, nothing, zero balance, I'm like, what the fuck, stayed up, again, another two hours, woke up again, check it again, the card, call it, nothing, zero balance, I'm like, what, what the fuck's going on? And then next day, same thing, nothing, nothing in the card. I'm like, oh, it's payday. Today's payday. I know that for a goddamn fucking fact. And uh, nope, zero balance. So I had to go to the company that there was a, that they like put the funds late or something like that. So it takes time or something like that. But they are they're like, oh, you're, you'll, you'll get paid today. You know, I'm like, okay, cool. That's all I wanted to know. I just want to know if I'm gonna get paid today. 
but hey, I got bills and all that, and hey, I want to buy, buy a few things, like, like I said, this is stuff like a, a splurge on, you know, it's kind of like, uh, how do you say it, like, it's not, well, it's not, for, not just for being a hobby, it's kind of like a vice to me, or maybe, or whatever, how that saying goes, like, you know, like, like this stuff, things, or whatever, this is what makes me happy, you know, or it doesn't have to, but, or I could have like a drink or whatever, Corona is like my vice, you know, and then just watching a, a cool, chill movie, you know, just, just want to kick back, steak, you know, fucking T-bone steak or whatever, and fucking little glass of wine or whatever, that's like, that's my vice or whatever, or Corona, so yeah, but having like the figures and collecting and buying and all that, I know some people or whatever, or for being who I am, they're like, oh, why you buy all that stuff, man, like, you're like, for being who you are and this and that, or grown, grown man, uh, because it's my hobby and this is what I'm into. That's why. Like, what the fuck, man? Like, I don't, I, I don't get that. That's, it's like whatever, man. That's why I hate when some people tell me shit like, oh, why do you waste like that on that action figure? You wasted a hundred and something dollars. Or like the Catwoman, resident. You fucking, it was like a hundred bucks, but it got eleven dollars off. I told him like, hey, can I get like a discount, man? Or what's like the best or lowest price you going? At? So he took eleven bucks off. I even told him, like, hey, you do know that these guys are, this one is, like, a defective, right? Or I've been seeing, I told him, I don't know, I told the guy from the comic shop, like, uh, I've been seeing a lot of videos that everybody keeps saying that one of the arms is broken. Like, even if you, like, barely start messing around with it, it breaks or it pops off real easily. So can you, like, give me, like, somewhat discount, you know, other than paying 100 bucks for this thing? And he's like, oh, I'll take off, uh, like, 11 something. I'm like, okay, deal, whatever, I'll take it. So yeah, and then the other ones, I guess, like like I said, the, the Terminator, I think this one was, uh, they had it for $27.99, the ultimate for this guy, and then for the other two, the, the ones that come in these packaging, these guys, these were $21.99, so there are a lot of the pricing or whatever you call it, it, it varies or whatever, so it's pretty cool, again, you go now it's kind of crazy, instead of going Toys R Us, it's like, we're starting to see like, they're putting at Target, but then now I noticed that Walmart has starting to get like some like Tom McFarlane figures and now and shit. I'm like oh shit, Tom McFarlane. I mean like yeah, McFarlane figures like brands and Figma and all that. I'm like oh shit, man. Like all these type of store brands are starting to get all these uh, brands of figures. So that's pretty cool. So you don't have to be just relying on just one place or store or whatever you call it. Even though in Canada and all that, Toys R Us is still there, so that's pretty cool. So it's not technically gone, it's still here, but here in the U.S. it's gone, so that kind of sucks. But at least now for being Target, like holy shit, you go you go to that section in the back where the pops, the Funko Pops and all that, and then poof, like a whole badass row, it's like holy shit, filled to the rim of NECA figures and all the Freddy Cougar, It, and the new it and the old one from the 91 movie and then fucking gizmo there's like a lot of figures and i'm like hmm, which one i want to get like damn there's a lot of shit like a lot of figures or things i want to collect or i want to buy but eh, like i said i stick to the terminator stuff but i did see all the predator they had all the fucking predator figures but those hopefully i'll hopefully they're still there they restock and hopefully those all the set of the three uh, arcade figures can't wait to get those so those Figures look fucking badass of the the classic line, but I want to get I wanted to get the Terminator ones first. So again, I still need to get the the T1000. They had him. They had like four or five in the damn store, but I'm like, eh, I'll get them later because I want to get I wanted to get the Catwoman. And then I put one figure in pre-order. I got I saw that when I got the Cat Catwoman, that was from the comic shop. I'm going through the aisle or whatever because it is a pretty big place, and I'm like looking, looking, looking. And then I like corner of my eye, I see like a, this like short little box, and I see like it says SH Monster. So I'm like, hey, what's this? I pull it, I'm like, I'm like fucking shaking his shit. I'm like, oh my god! Nah, just kidding. <laughs> it's like, um, it was Kyrum. Like, oh shit, fuck, they have him. You gotta hide this motherfucker. You gotta. Nah, just kidding, no. But, but I'm like, damn, this is a small ass little box compared to all the other SH Monster uh, boxes. The, the Kairu, the battle damage, it, I guess it's the, the latest one or the last one or whatever. Oh, the 2003 uh, Mechagodzilla. It's a T. 
like a tiny ass little box like oh shit but damn the price tag a hundred and eighty seven dollars what <laughs> damn but eh, whatever it gives in certain parts of the United States, like like I said, I'm from from Texas and shit, so I guess everywhere is like fuck. Like certain places has to be like super expensive, and then you go online, you can find it for what 80, 90 bucks, the same one. But like I said, like I don't like doing the whole online thing because ever since bullshit happened with my fucking card, so that's why I don't trust the whole online crap, or I don't even know if it if I get the fucking item and then it's all broken, all destroyed and shit package all ripped up and shit oh yeah i wasted 80 bucks yeah it's cool the whole point is to get the figure but hey i do want the case or the box or whatever you call it kind of in pristine uh, condition you know not all fucked up but again but again that's like my opinion my thing like i choose not to get things online even though everybody tells me and other youtubers and i've asked questions and comments like hey man you could get it from amazon like the like the one that i have the the godzilla 2001 the GMK I was asking though see another youtuber that guy the what's his name see I don't, I don't even remember like these guys names but it's another SH Monster Arts a youtuber does badass videos and I love his videos and then you got that other crazy motherfucker what's his name the DG whatever the fuck the one that always makes fucking all those crazy ass videos of Shin Godzilla and shit or whatever his name is the one that swivel and ball joint ball joint ball joint you know that, that guy <laughs> so i love his channel too man it's fucking funny as hell and shit and, and again into the same thing so it's like i'm i don't know why some people make a big deal like for being me like oh you're into that type of stuff you're you know like you collect this things i'm like yeah i do and what of it or what is it to you so again, I don't know anyone out there in the real world or YouTube land, if you guys have people like that or relatives or friends that, you know, tell you shit like, hey, why are you into this stuff? Because, because I want to? What the fuck? Because I like it? I love it? What the fuck? Stupid. You don't see me telling you shit about your life or telling you what to do in your fucking life. Don't tell me shit. But anyways, but yeah. So I just wanted to bring this up, like haul video of the, these figures that I got today, and can't wait to do the unboxing using the new the 4K, you know, quality, so you guys can see all the detail, I guess, of the figures and yeah, check it out. So hope you guys like, share, and all that craziness, and catch you in the next video. And take it easy.